In today's video, I have six tips for you to help you communicate better. Let's get into the video. Always have your chin up. Head back, chin up. This shows signs of confidence. Every time that anyone is in a confrontational situation, when you expose a weaker part of yourself, like exposing your chest, exposing your throat, it shows confidence because you are showing the other person you're not worried. From now on, every time that you are talking to someone, stop looking at your phone, stop looking at the ground, look them dead center in the eyes and always have your chin up. Shoulders back. This helps your chest to breathe better. So instead of being like this, instead of being like this, shoulders back and help your chest go up. This will help you breathe much better and feel much better about yourself. Voice down, speak slower and with tonality. Most people, when they are talking to someone else, for the most part, they are stressed out. So their voice is coming from their throat. If you notice, people like radio hosts and people that have great voices, they are much more relaxed. Ever noticed when you wake up, your voice is much different than throughout the day? There's a reason for it. Getting stressed out throughout the day, so you start getting like very concentrated around the throat. So start relaxing, breathe in, breathe out, start letting go of stress and your natural voice will start coming through. Always look people that center in the eyes. You read them better. If they are lying to you, you'll notice something is off. But they are speaking the truth. You see congruence with their body language and the way that they are talking. There's no way for you to read people unless you are looking them in the eyes. You'll become much more efficient when you're looking them because you see them. You can see right through them. So make a point from now on. Start looking at people that center in the eyes. Don't agree with people right away. You'll be surprised that for the most part, people tend to, to connect, they tend to agree right away. And this is stupid. Developments are made out of disagreement. Listen to what people are telling you, but don't be keen on agreeing with people right away. Now you have a situation where people are trying to connect with you, get a little bit in your space in a good way, because try, they're trying to reach out, they're trying to connect, but you're not trying to connect with people. You are independent. And the way for you to do that is lean back, listen to what they're telling you. They don't agree right away. Make them talk. Be the one that talks less. You start gaining control of the conversation. The one that speaks less and asks more questions is in control. You're not always available and you are ready to walk away. Ever noticed when you actually have somewhere to attend to and you are having a situation with someone, let's say a conversation, or a job interview or talking to a client. If you actually have to go to a different meeting, like in 30 minutes, you'll engage in a conversation with that person in a different way because you're showing them, I have 30 minutes for this. Be ready to walk away. From their perspective, now they have a perception of you having more value than initially because you're ready to just walk away. Make a habit of doing this and you'll be in a position of control. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Remember to subscribe and click that notification bell so you'll know when I make more videos like this. Peace.